Hey there friends. Today on this Tech Talk tutorial video, we are going to be resetting this Belkin N300 router to its factory default settings. This is really something you need to know how to do if you've purchased this router used like we have, or if you're going to be reselling it slash donating it and need to wipe all of your security settings off of this. It's a very simple process. I'm going to show you how to do that right now. Okay, to accomplish this reset, you're going to need just a couple of things. Number one, you're going to need uh, some sort of a pin or uh, a, a nice point in order to hit the reset button. I'm using actually the cell phone SIM card key, which you can purchase uh, in the description box below. These are great to kind of have around for these kind of things. You're also going to need the default password and router setting for uh, your specific router. Now that can be found usually on the bottom of this router. And uh, basically, as long as you have those, you can reset it and uh, be able to access this again. If you're looking for how to reset the password, uh, actually, uh, or the administrator names slash router name, I'm gonna put that uh, video in the description box below. So again, for this, all we're doing is we're resetting the router to default factory configurations. And on the back of the router, you're going to find this little reset button down here at the bottom. You can see that it's uh, it's basically just a, that little red button. And in order to get to it, that's where we need our little SIM card key. Or like I said, if you have another pointed object you can use. So basically what we're going to do with our key here is press that red button. And we're going to hold it for 15 seconds. That's been about three seconds, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Now that's gonna officially recycle the router. What you're gonna do is you're gonna see this little light on top here is gonna go off and then it'll take a couple seconds here to recycle and then you'll see this light begin to blink again indicating as you can see there that has been recycled to its factory default settings from here you can actually follow your instruction booklet to reset the router up for a new network or at this point you can unplug it and you're good to go to resell it or to donate it uh, friends i hope that's helped Hit that thumbs up button if this has. It helps us make more great tutorial videos. And hit subscribe. we got a lot more videos coming up soon. If you're looking for that password reset uh, function video, we're going to be doing that in the description box below. All right. Take care, friends.